The World Bank will provide $1 billion in direct budget support to Ethiopia in the next few months, the Prime Minister has said, more than 13 years after the body and other donors suspended budgetary help over a disputed election in 2005. Speaking on Saturday at his first press conference since taking power in April, Abiy Ahmed credited his government's economic and political changes for the development. The World Bank and other donors suspended budgetary support after a disputed poll in 2005. In late July, Ahmed met with World Bank Group President Jim Yang Kim in Washington, D.C. during his visit to the United States. Since his election, the 42-year-old has overseen a number of changes, including restoring diplomatic ties with neighboring Eritrea after two decades, pledging to open up state-owned enterprises to outside investment, and releasing thousands of prisoners. Ethiopia has over the past years been one of Africa's fastest growing economies, according to the World Bank.